Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome back to our Majora's Mask Randomizer. So, uh, even after getting hookshot and like fire arrows and stuff, there's still only a few things we can actually do. So one of the things we're doing is the second uh, skull house. Uh, I'm trying to remember the best way to do this. Yeah. Uh, you get a second... Oh, uh, well, it's fine. So there are two prizes in here, uh, one of which is for completing it on the first day, the other is for completing it on day two or three. We're obviously not going to make the day one uh, cutoff, unfortunately. You need so many items for this. Well, it's like hookshot and fire arrows, but yeah. Uh, but pretty much we need to do this, uh, we need to go back to the sword guys uh, on the morning of day two to get our reward for that we need to go and do the Goron chest uh, in the labyrinth game in clock town uh, all right remember how to do this one directly above me and is so touchy really the hitbox for like that particular Skatula and a few other ones are so rough man actually we may make the day one cutoff okay I don't remember exactly what all of them are but I'll see I know where quite a few of them are because I uh, had to do this twice uh, my <laughs> first playthrough. Because I came in to do it, got soft locked about halfway through because I didn't have Goron or Hookshot. Uh, I didn't have Song of Soaring either. That was fun. But we will need to eventually come back because uh, you need the captain's hat to talk to these skull guys. Stealth children. And uh, you get a piece of heart at the end of it. You need to talk to them to get a particular code. And the code is random, as far as I know. Uh, can I just grab that? Yeah. Oh, um, okay. That. Ah, uh, yeah, it's like, uh, shoot the red one on your fifth attempt or something like that. So it's like, not easy. Uh, it's like, I should say it's not easy to guess. Uh, there we go. Okay, take that off. Okay. Cool. Says this one here, which is actually annoying. I th can I actually do this with a, uh, Thought about to be an error. It's good to know. I remember I was missing that one for ages because I didn't realize how to get up here. Uh, Alright. Oh. There's a couple in here. Oh my god. I was like, I'll just hit it with my sword, it'll be fine. There, right, yeah. Right, is that room done? Yeah, we actually, I, I thought, for whatever reason, I forgot that the day ch changed at 6 a.m., not uh, midnight. So that's fine. Oh man. Going back to playing this after Master of Time, where like the funky uh, pixel isn't right in the middle, is so annoying. Hopefully it's not too disorientating for you guys. I don't know why it happens. I don't know if it's like a ROM issue or what. I mean, an issue with my cartridge. Yeah, that's the one. I actually really wish I had a uh, N64 cart for Majora's. I've got the like master collection for GameCube, but... Uh, where? 
can't remember where this other one is. Oh, I forgot about him. He actually didn't hit me that time. Every other time he always used to hit me. One on the roof or some shit. Uh, I don't remember what any of these things are, man. Man, it's like trying to hit that freaking uh, ball in Master of Time. There we go. Ah. Well, hello there. Son of a bitch. Whatever, I'll get you on the way back. Oh my god. It's the bunny hood, yeah. Alright, 15. I could be using Deku sticks for this, but... I have fire arrows, I'm gonna damn well use them. I was like, is there one up there? If there is, am I gonna get hit by it? Okay. I'm glad that worked, because I didn't know what else to do. That's how throwing a bomb, I guess. I think you can use Goron. Rolling works just as well. Ah, yeah, that's not one up there. Look too much. Okay. Go through here. Oh, that's right. This is Majora's. I can't do that. Very specifically. How does it not die from like the burning web? Whatever. It's like, yeah. Yeah, we're murdering this one. Oh, that's right, it's like behind there, yeah. I was like, where is it? I can't see it. Yeah, pretty sure there's another one. Alright. Should just be the last room where the other stealth kids are. So, this is a room where you have to, like, uh, shoot the masks or some. Yeah, you gotta shoot the masks that are different colors, in particular orders. The last one I got didn't actually use, um, I don't know if there's any in there, there's one up there, okay. Uh, yeah, the last one I got didn't actually use one of the colours, it was like three colours, but it's a code of six, so it's like, I had to hit multiple masks multiple times in a particular order, so there's just no way I could guess it. Just never gonna happen. Okay. I do like that there's portraits of, like, uh, Skull Kid. <laughs> really funny. I'll find him anyway. Damn it. Son of a bitch. Okay. I'm hoping there's, like, four more in here. Oh boy, I just killed him. I'm sorry. Can't be perfect. Anyway. Come for the Zelda content, you stay for the good singing. Clearly. Come on. Okay. I'm like missing one and we a little bit mad. That's the gate. Is the one I'm missing? Yeah, I forgot about that. 
a whole hookshot point in the rafters just for this one. Okay. That's cool. So I never actually checked the whether the rewards are split uh, between day one and day two and three. Uh, I kind of, well, I really hope they're not. So in the original game, if you complete this on day one, you get the wallet. And if it's day two or three, you just get like rupees. Uh, but when I originally did this, I completed it on day three and got like, you know, an actual item. Alright. But I had some loud noise inside the game, check it out. Place some sort of underground shelter, did you find this place? Okay, you let me have this place, not for free of course, I hope this will do. Uh What does that do? Hmm. Okay. Go check out that chest. Uh so in Clock Town there's a chest in the inn that you need the key for. Go to that. Go for the chest or something? That Goron will actually be there. Oh, uh, which is kind of funny. We'll, uh, walk in on him. I never checked that chest today. They didn't have a hook shot. I mean, I know it's nothing, but. Uh, Woodfall map. Sure. Uh, what else to? Yeah, I don't know. Pretty sure this is locked, but I'll just double check. Nope. Is it because I have the key, I wonder? Uh, this one. Boss key? Oh, no. The boss key is behind getting the room key, which means I have to do the scatolas every time I want to get this particular boss key. What boss key is it? Great pay. We have the song. We have, okay, we have the song. We just need to somehow find Zoro between now and then. Uh, and then somehow complete Great Bay, or at the very least get to the boss in Great Bay. That's... that's pretty bad. Uh, okay. I don't know where any Great Bay keys are. <laughs> that's really funny. The, the actual action you're meant to take in the game to get the room key gives a Great Bay key. Okay, two Great Bay things uh, tied to the frickin... Ah... Uh... Are they... Yeah. <sighs> that sucks. <gasps> ah, that's really bad. Okay. Are these open all night, or no? 6am. Alright. Uh, I guess we just wait till day two to do this. So at least see what the item is. And then, yeah. So I'll be back. We'll just do this. Go to Dawn of the Second. Hope that one of these is Zora. And go smash out Great Bay. Man, that's so depressing. So depressing. Uh... Alright, what is this? Last time I did this, it was a boss key. It's at least... It's not gold, okay? That's fine. It means I don't actually have to do this. Because this could actually be annoying. Yep. Right. Trapped like some sort of a rat. Oh my god. Wow. 
Well, that's pretty good. Okay. Have to be able to let... Okay, okay. Okay. There is a way to cheese it, and I don't know how to do it. Actually, could I? No. I was like, could I go back to being a kid and just hook shot to the chest? But that's definitely not allowed. Unfortunate. No, I'm good. Okay. Nothing in there. That's not Zora. Uh, okay. Very quickly running out of things to do again. Hopefully this is... I, I hope this is Zoro. Nope. Let's go! I mean, now I have to go and do my least favorite temple, but that's fine. <sighs> like, 50 things just popped up in my tracker. Because we can do, like, all of Gerudo, uh, the pirate area... Uh, there's, there's a lot of chests we can do now, but we're gonna go do Great Bay. Someone keeps commenting, are there even dungeons in this game? Yes, so we're gonna go do one right now. Actually, I, because I have Zora, I can go get Gold Dust. Uh, now I'm actually gonna kill these things because... Don't worry, it's actually a bitch to get out of the water. Oh, I can go and do a fucking beavers. Yay. Said no one ever. Uh, although I do have a quality of life thing on for beavers. Which is you only have to do one race per item. You don't actually have to. You have to race the little brother first, which is nice. This saves you like 20 minutes. <laughs> so far, we're just missing like. Uh, Alright, we need to actually see the gold dust. There you go. Oh, it's free. Okay, I have to pay for it. Nice. Alright. Now that's out of the way. Let's swim past Macau as Macau. Uh, yeah, so what I was trying to say before I cut myself off. Missing three songs to do with the temples, uh, and two boss keys. I don't know where one of the boss keys is. Uh, where want this one? Okay, just a uh, nothing chest, but we'll have a look anyway. I mean, it's not under rupees. It ain't nothing. Well, uh, so you can do a thing here where you use a plagiarized song, or you 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 find out about the song, you play it for old mate, and he's like, "Oh, I can use this song." Um, but we know it's money, so we need to do that. There's a shop here too. Mm. Uh, I think it's fine. Just go to Great Bay. I really don't want to, but anyway. Uh, left up, left, right down, left, right. Now the turtle comes out. She's like, hey, what about my eggs? He's like, shut the hell up. You ain't ever getting your eggs back. I ate them. Tasted great. Alright. Take me to the temple. I don't want to collect the fairies if I can help it. Actually, the, the main goal here is to kill the boss. We can kill the boss, we can come back and do the rest of the temple later if we have to. Because there's a fairy there, but it's 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 effort. Uh, I want to check. Okay, we do need to turn that. Uh, it's been a hot minute, and again, I don't like this dungeon. Dungeon is very finicky. Okay. 
make the platforms move. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Go down there. Again, main focus right now is complete the dungeon. The fuck out of my face. Actually, I do kind of want that heart. I always wait for the second cycle. I'm sure there's like a shortcut way to get to the boss. I don't know what it is. Uh, I know that we need to at least go and turn on the red water, I think. Um, there's nothing through there, I don't think. Yeah, we just get into that room. Oh, that's something. Uh, I should, maybe I shouldn't do that. Use that magic. And I do need magic for getting across that room. That's unfortunate. Okay. Uh, that's very Fuck off, dude. There we go. Okay. I was like, am I trapped? I was like, can I not do this yet because I haven't turned the water on? No, it's fine. Okay. I was like, it has to be like magic and other stuff, surely. Okay. Alright, so that was a small key. That sucks. Particularly since it was for Stone Tower. If it was like any of the other dungeons, I wouldn't have cared. But anyway. Anywho. That's definitely the easiest way to do that. Uh, this has been my TED talk on how to speedrun Majora's Mask. Okay, another chest up there. What about the chest in there? Nothing. Sick. Okay, that's good. It means I don't have to do the mini boss. That yeah, whatever. I'll just cop the hit. In this game, I have a shield. Okay. That's pretty good. Uh, pick since I'm about to get hit, I guess. Uh, where is double defense in Draco? Hold on this Draco. Am I blind? Uh, well, look, I can't see it. So... That's fine. Great. Uh, wait, isn't there like a chest in here? Sure is. Dude, water temple's loaded, man. I was like, I was holding shield, wasn't I? Oh my god. It's like the same button to surface and open, so like, I've missed it so many times. Giant wallet. Uh, again, it's actually pretty useless. But that's okay. Like, at this point, I cannot complain. 
all things considered. Where am I? Oh, I'm on the wrong... Yeah, we can't complain at all over like what we have and what we don't have right now. So yeah, we don't need to go that way because it's just a mini boss that leads to a, a uh, dead chest. Well, a, a, not, a chest that we do not need. Mm. Right, we're gonna go up here, freeze them. I just realized I don't have a key. Mm. How much of this dungeon can I do without a key? Maybe. Okay, this means we can't do that mini boss, which leads to ice arrows, I think. All oh, right. So. Yeah, how do I get? Oh, okay, I was like, hang on. <laughs> how do I get out? <laughs> I want to get off the table. Let me off the table. Let me out. Oh, Thank you. This is the right place. I don't even know, dude. Oh, I want to be over there. No. Ow. Magic. Magic's pretty good. I mean, here's hoping we can do this without. Uh. Without a key, that would be sweet. Alright, so what we want to do is just hook shit up there. Such a weird little thing. Like, why that hookshot point is there. It's, it's, I don't know. There's just something about that particular thing I don't like. Should reverse the water, I think. Ah, oh, it like stops it. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, if you're wondering uh, about the fairies, I am just sincerely hoping they're nothing. Like, that, that is my honest hope. Uh, or at the very least, Great Bay and Stone Tower. Snowhead I can deal with, um, unless it's a boss key, in which case I'm just getting very sad. Uh, and uh, obviously Woodfall is like pretty easy. But yeah, if it's like uh, a boss key in um, I was like, I'm gonna miss that, aren't I? Yeah, it's a boss key that's part of the fairies. I'm in a lot of trouble. All right, don't actually full flip this time. I like that they added in flips for Link and stuff. Like it's cool, but at the same time, I'm like, is it really necessary? back this way. Should have changed the direction of the water. Yep. Yeah, we need the green. Like I can't see shit right now. I think this is right. Again, like, I don't know how to, like, cheese to get to the boss easy. The only way I know how to do it is to actually, like, do the dungeon. Oh, that's just the boss there. Alright, uh, okay. This one's the boss. So this won't do anything because we haven't done the other one. 
Uh, you can't hookshot to boss doors, I assume. I can't remember. Doubt it. Yeah. Be nice if you could. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's do this. Pretty sure that's where I came out. I want to. How I exit. Ah, oh, it's like inverted. Fairy there. Okay, good to know. Ah, uh, now this room I don't like. Right. Not this room. The one we actually have to go in. Almost exploded. Yeah, this room is really awkward, actually. Okay, I don't think I'm in any kind of a rush. Pretty sure I just want to go to here. I don't know what's up there. I assume it's just a fairy. I am still trying to like keep my eye out for keys and stuff. I have a map for this. I do. Oh, I don't have a map. I only have a boss key. Okay. Luckily for me, the boss key is all I need. Uh. Okay. How does this work? That. Yeah. And I got a defrost thing above me. Okay. Let's try to remember specifically how this worked. What was the point in me doing this one in particular just to get up there? Or I could go the long way to do something. I can't remember why we went the long way. Is it just for a fairy? Oh, there's a switch up there. Damn it. Yeah, okay, that's right. I remember doing this now. Okay. I did the exact same thing last time. Uh, yep. Yeah. This. This, we can go up and turn that. Uh, there's no water flowing. That's bad. How do I get in there? I think it's a fairy. I think. Where's that water cut? Kind of, not really coming in that room. I can't remember how to get in there, dude. Almost like I should be able to make it. Oh, okay, hang on, hang on. This work. So the biggest problem with dungeons, sorry, I thought I'd just been talking to myself for a second there. I actually know that's fine. Um, is fairy chests look gold? Like fairy chests are gold. So this will be a fairy, but I had to be sure. All right, can I have magic? Oh, magic. Hello. Alrighty then, let's go fuck myself, that's fine.
Uh, no, we have to do this, unfortunately. I didn't feel like I missed a switch in the previous room. Oh, we'll figure it out. At least this is like day two and not like day three at night and I'm like rushing. Go down there. Yeah, okay, I missed something. Oh, hang on. What's that? Yeah, okay, I can have it out. Oh, there is something in there. For some reason I thought there wasn't. God damn it. Whatever. I'm on the also on the absolute worst side for this. But anyway. Yeah, my timing is impeccable. I will say, I do like the combined usage of fire arrows and ice arrows in this dungeon. So there's things in this dungeon I like, and it's mechanically it's a cool idea, right? You're going into different rooms, and even this like multiple rooms at different times because you're changing the water flow and stuff. Uh, do I need you specifically? Do well, I mean, I should probably use you, use you specifically, but this one. I get closer. God damn it. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Thank you. Why are they one way? Anyway, that should be everything. I know there's like a fairy in here somewhere, it's like up in the roof, and you know, I just really don't care. I don't want to care. Alright, let's go. Uh, don't go in there, you fuck. Okay, cool. Better get mad. Go to the bottom. In fact, I think there's a fairy in that jar in the middle. Okay. Should be boss time. I really wish I had more magic, but anyway. Fine, I think. Would be worse. Uh, specifically want magic for, um... Beast deity. Like, there's probably magic down there, but... I'm already up here, you know. Oh, never mind. <laughs> All right, let's go get magic. Uh, it's... I can't Link's literally like fucking ninja Link as he's Zoro. All right. That like this took longer than it should have, but I mean, we basically full cleared the dungeon outside of fairies. And considering we didn't use a single key, uh, I think we did a pretty good job. In fact, the only key door I remember seeing was uh, to the eyeball minibus. Where you normally get ice arrows. Ah, uh, okay. And you're out of your f goddamn mind if you think I'm doing this boss legit. I hate this boss fight. First deity and makes this boss fight actually bearable. By basically being I just stand on the side and click sword. Like a hero. We're gonna watch the full animation. You gotta love this data link. So good. Where is he? Oh, he's down there. Oh, 
The whole fight, boys. Don't fall in the water, please. Go. Uh, so we should get something in replace of Oath to Order, because this is our first uh, dungeon. And you always get the remains. Uh, so the remains aren't random, obviously. 50 rupees and a bottle of milk. So the 50 rupees instead of the heart container, and then the bottle of milk uh, is Oath to Order. So that's pretty cool. Just normal milk. Uh, I got that. We're at five bottles? Sick. Oh, and we got... Uh, this one. Nice. Uh, well. That's one temple done. So I guess, like, considering how... Actually, I don't, don't need to worry about catching up. Considering how bad it could have been, like, with the boss key situation, uh, it was probably best case scenario that we got that boss key tied to that minigame. Uh, I want to check. There's a shop I need to check. I need to check uh, Old Love's room. Twenty rupees, sick. Actually, what are you selling? Uh, is this your room? Hopefully, sends to the sea breeze. I'm so I'm sorry, but I'd like you rent this room to me. Oh, it's like green potion. Okay. okay. Twenty rupees if I give him the mountain thing, and yeah. not worth it. And then we go check the shop, which is somewhere around here. Nothing in the water, is there? No. Trying to make it look like I intentionally fell into the water. Alright. Uh, yes, piece hard. Okay, that's kind of cool. Ah, oh, you're rupees. Ah, oh, damn. Two. Alright, and red potion. Cool. Alright, well, what else can we do now? It's funny how much of the... Uh, actually, that's it. Don't tell Smokey. Sorry, I'm just updating them. Uh, water cove, underwater chest. Real cool, cool. Uh, let's go back to clock down for now. Because we can go and do the play the song for the gossip stones. Should be pretty good. Pretty like easy check to do. Just gotta remember specifically where they all are. You. This check up here wants me. Oh right. Uh, pretty sure it's this one. So this thing is a little bit weird. You have to be like right in front of the uh. The gossip zone to get it to work. And you have to be of the race that's tied to the song. So, because this is like the only song I have, I had to have Mikhail. Okay. 
I think that's how it works. It has to be in front of the big one. Yeah, cool. I couldn't remember if it had to be always be the third one or like the, the number corresponding to the thing or if it had to be the big one. Because obviously the first one we looked at, it was the third one anyway. So the next, the next big thing we really need is the mask to get into Ikana. Uh, which I think has to be Gibdo or uh, or this one. I am this one. And then Captain's hat would be nice, but not purely necessary. But it does unlock a lot of stuff. But yeah, I mean, we're sitting pretty darn good, like, we have our three transformation masks, most of it is chasing songs, uh, in terms of Sonata, Lullaby, and Elegy, but we'll get there eventually. That should give us a chest, uh, let's see what it is. Hoping it's a like permanent item. Twenty rupees, great. All that effort for twenty goddamn. Oh, we can go into the boat now. Actually, that we've cleared. Um, the boat mini game. That mini game is actually really hard. Uh, but we go. We will go and do it. Since we've beaten. Uh, Georg, so we may as well. A shop. Fifty rupees. Can I have that, please? Well, 50 rupees and like. Oh, my game just glitched out. Something this. Alright, let's go and do stupid beavers. see what it was, ah, oh, whatever. First one I don't need to see. Like, I have to do it anyway. I may fail this just because I'm not the greatest Zora swimmer in the world. But, we'll see. There's gonna be like no commentary, dude. I am concentrating very hard right now. You can sort of afford to like mess up like once in this one, but the second one you just like cannot afford to mess up. Also, those rings actually do have a hitbox too, so you can like run into the ring. Oh, perfect. Uh, okay. They're like over there now? Yeah. Okay, 
Okay, so the first lot of beaver was a bust. That's fine. He's back. Um. Jump. Do this again. It's a different course from memory? Or it's like slightly different? I don't know. Maybe it's the same. All I know is it's stressful. Maybe it's the same. Also, why I like using a GameCube controller, it's so much easier to do like some of this. That's what I was saying. Uh, the ring has a hitbox. As soon as I start praising the, the controller, I'm like, oh yeah, controller is so good for precision movement. Fucking smash my head open. Ugh. Yeah, this is the one I hate actually. Oh, no, that's fine. Maybe it's like different courses on different days. I just don't remember it being like this specifically. Oh boy. It's two more. 28 seconds. Nice. Hey, give me something good, please. Means we can start the Kayfay and Andrew quest and give the letter to the old lady. <laughs> Please let it be over. And I feel that. Uh, can I warp out of here? We want to go and do the boat mini game while we can. Kayfay must is nice because yeah, we can. Take the letter to Mama actually to her on the night of the third. Uh, and we can talk to Anju on after about 1.30ish. It's like after the postman comes in on day one. And she'll be like, oh you're looking for Kefe, come and see me at like 11.30 tonight. And you go and see her and she gives you the letter. Uh, we don't know where that is yet. Uh, although last time that was actually vanilla for me. So maybe it's vanilla again. Who knows. Um, Oh yeah, she'll at least give us something. And if it's not letter, that's fine. All right, this whole mini game, by the way, is like jumping from the middle path to the one of the four torches, like whichever one's lit. Uh, the camera changes constantly. It's not fun. Okay. Uh, yeah, and yet. Like, see how the camera's like all fucky? 20 rupees to try. Okay, that's fine. But yeah, and you can't like see every torch at all times. You gotta like guess and. Yeah. Oh man. I couldn't hear it, so I assumed it was like behind me. Oh, I'm almost falling off. If you fall off, you have to get back on the boat to come back. It's so annoying. I mean, I don't need it again. I don't even freaking remember, dude. But you see how like the camera's shifting? So I'm having to like hold in very particular directions. Like Yeah. I... Oh my god. I think it's 20, right? Uh which one is it? Oh, I thought I missed. Oh, 
Sorry, I'm like <laughs> full gamer leaning. Oh my god, that took me like six attempts my first time. <sighs> Son of a bitch. Oh, I think you're saving up for a big ship. Big ship, little ship. Uh, okay, so we can do the whole of the Gerudo Fortress uh, from start to finish. Kind of don't want to do that right now, but it's kind of all we can do. Uh, what else? Yeah. Oh, I mean, look, we've achieved a lot in today's episode, so that's going to do a soft list one. We've actually done a dungeon. Uh, yeah, we got like our third transformation mask, a bunch of other masks, stuff like that. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the series. If you are, feel free to leave a like, and I'll see you next time. Have a good day. Mm -hmm.